Welcome back to Discover San Diego. I'm your host, Jason Yoss. I'm here with Katie Pond. Katie, good to see you. Good to see you too. Thanks for having me, Jason. So we know San Diego. We love San Diego. We yes, want we our do. audience to love San Diego as well. And one of the great things about San Diego are these beautiful enclaves like Encinitas. Katie, you live in Encinitas. Tell me a little bit about Encinitas. Encinitas is just an amazing place to live. It's an amazing place to work. My office is also in Encinitas. We've raised our family there. Um, it's just a quintessential Southern California beach town with its roots in surf culture, um, funky art, great food scene. Um, and the thing I love about it is just community. Community is a great word for there. Uh, you know, it has that special downtown, kind of like uh, some of the other cities. Uh, what's your favorite restaurant there? Oh my gosh, there's some new ones popping up. I'm a huge fan of Urban Sea. Um, their cocktails and food are incredible. There's so many good ones. It just depends. I mean, that's the dangerous part of having my office down there is yeah, realtors. constantly going out to lunch, coffee. <laughs> Realtor Thursday, Realtor Friday, absolutely. That's, that's right, but so many. I mean, great pizza places, Corner Pizza, Pandora's reopening up and relaunching, some new places opening up. So it's just, I mean, it's a great place to be. What about real estate? The great thing about Encinitas, I hear, is that you have two sides. You have the coastal side and you have the inland side. Talk to me about the differences and how you navigate You know your favorite parts. So I think it really... Finding your place in Encinitas is really kind of what you're all about, what your family's all about. Um, you have your hardcore people that want to be as close to the coast as possible. I fall into that category, willing to give up anything really to just be that much closer to the ocean. Um, and then you have your people who are into equestrian, want more of an estate style home, want space, want to raise chickens and all that. Right. They're in Olivenhain. Um, and then you have just so many great little suburban areas um, great school system um, and really nothing's that far from the beach so I, you can't really go wrong but it just depends on what your family needs are absolutely uh, you know I really appreciate a lot of that good insight because you're right you can go everywhere from equestrian to surfer not only in the same day but in the same town absolutely yep <laughs> Katie thanks so much for joining us on here audience make sure you stay tuned next week we'll see you then thank you